Hello, Badger mates. We are back at Undertale, and yes, I'm still filming the same night. I know, it's two in the morning, and I still can't sleep. Haha. <laughs> I'll probably, after this one, I'm going to go to bed and then do some more later. So, we are back, and we are off to go into an adventure to another place. I'm still wearing the same lipstick, because of life, by Rimmel London, and my grill shirt. Let's see. Morning, dog marriage. Uh-oh. Oh, what is that thing, Jerry? Um, uh, let's deal with the, the ice cap. You managed to tear your eyes away from ice cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Why are we doing this? What a fail. Ah! Focus. Jerry eats powdery food and licks his hands loudly. Uh, let's go with um, ice cap again. Can you not look into ice cap's hat? It seems defeated. Better. Guys, it's cold. Does anyone care? Okay, there we go. Whew. Jerry eats powdery food and licks his hands loudly. Okay, I'm going to spare Ice Cap. Well, can you give me a ride home? He's so lazy. Jerry eats powdery food and licks his hands loudly. Um, let's see. Let's check on. Everyone knows Jerry. Makes the text two seconds longer. Huh? Did they ditch me? Some friends. Um, I think I'm just gonna spare him. Awkward. Jerry sneezes while covering his nose. Huh? Did they ditch me? Some friends. I'm just gonna spare you. So, like, what are you even doing? Fine. Tells everyone has to go to the bathroom. Well, that's great, Jerry. I'm gonna ditch you? You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. You won. <laughs> I just didn't want to ditch them. It's not very nice. <laughs> okay, fine. What is this? X marks the spot. Okay, let's go and get the X. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click! Oh, that was horrible. Uh-oh. Okay. What's that? What's that smell? What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you smell, identify your smell. Jazz hands. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Exterminate. Eliminate you. Doggy a saucy all oh, they're kissing. Um I'm going to roll around. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Take my wife's fleas. Don't actually. Oh snap. Ah! Ah! Okay. They want to resmell you. Um, actually, don't resmell me. Do, uh, eh, mm, nice cream. <laughs> An illustration of a hug. Your HP is maxed out. Take my wife's fleas. Don't actually. Okay. Ah! Okay, there we go. I still got hit, but that's okay. Oh, wait, no. I don't want that. I want to be re-snipped. The dog sniff you again. After rolling in the dirge, you smell alright. What? Smells like a... You're actually a little puppy? Yes, I am. There we go. Oh, I didn't get it! Yes! The dog thinks you are maybe a lost puppy. Um, I'm going to pet you. Wow! Pet by another pup! Don't leave me out! Oh no! That's a stinky attack. Thinks that you might be a lost puppy. I will pet you. You pet the Risa. What about me? Dog that pets dogs, amazing. Okay. Oh crud, I got hit. I should have gone. Dog's mind. 
have been expanded. Oh, yes! Spare! I'm gonna spare you so you can spare me! You won! 40 gold! Ooh! Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy! No problem. I don't want to die. Hold on. I have nine health. Do I go back? Hold on. Turn every X into a zero, then press the switch. Oh, okay. Oh. I messed up the puzzle. Why is this? There we go. Okay, I just didn't need to go all the way through. That was my bad. There we go. Okay, perfect. Yes! What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? I... ate it. Really? Wowie! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then. Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> Thank you, Papyrus. Let's see. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> sure. Cool guy taking care of him. Human. Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. So I suppose what I'm saying is, worry not, human. I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum. We can then both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I will not give away the answer. But you just said you didn't know how. Let's go like this. Let's go like that. Nope! Didn't mean to do that! Curse me. Ooh, I'm gonna mess this up. Let's do that again. I was onto something and then I lost it. Um... Actually... No, no. What am I thinking? Um... Okay. Okay, there's that, and then I'm gonna go around. No, oh! oh, that was my bad. Don't hit those spikes. Oh, good gravy. Don't hit anything else that you don't need to. Wow! You solved it! And you did it all without my help! Incredible! My, I'm impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do! Well, I'm sure you will love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Okay, <laughs> Papyrus. Sans! My buddy, my good old friend. Good job in solving that it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Nope. Don't need your help. Boom, 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 boom. Hey! I was looking for something and I can't find it. It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Elphis. 
You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Sure. Great, then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. So purple and blue are okay and pink. When I pull the switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> Get ready. Okay. Let's hopefully... It, meh. <laughs> yes. Hold on. <laughs> he just goes away. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up next year, he'll even make something edible. See, this is what happens when you pest the lesser dog too much. It's the broken head of a snow dog. Oh, good. Oh, be aware of dog. Peas, pet dog. On the floor inside the box are palmer raisins. Knowing that the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog fills you with determination. Yay! A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions, but as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. Its necks got longer and longer, and added more more snow until it was rather sad to watch. But I couldn't turn away. Uh-oh. Um, I hate the ice. I think I did this wrong. Yeah, I'm just gonna gonna fall off the edge. Hee, <laughs> snowman! It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it in red marker. <laughs> okay. Let's do this correctly. Um let's do this. Puzzles, puzzles, puzzles. Oh good. Okay, I got it. Second time's the charm, eh? Yay! Do, 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 do. And I got snow on my head. I'm gonna go down. What's up? What's up? Not much. Oh, I got another. Graffat confronts you. Act. Undecorate. You move the box. Non-related reasons. Ugh, ouch. Glasses going into my stuff. That's a little better. Whoa, I'm so lucky. Graffat's slightly less irritated. Undecorate. You have the linear cursed bookmark of a smug teenager winking. That's a little better. No! Pay attention, Natalia. You can't pay attention, can you? You will die soon. You have the striped candy cane that says this is a tiny cane to walk on it. A weight has been lifted. Oh, God's problems have been taken away. Yay! Spare. 
You won 20 gold. Are you lost? No. Say, are you following me? Maybe. What if I want to follow you? Oh, pretty. It's a door. It's a door. Okay, fine. Be that way. What are you doing over here, Sans? What are you doing here? Are you evil or something? You should really like to exercise, yes. Or are you just mocking me? Don't appreciate the mocking. Um, what a tiny doghouse. Oof. I feel like... Okay, if I get attacked... I will just use an item. Oh no. Oh yeah. I guess I'm using an item. Uh, okay. I'm going to pet you. Greater dog is too far away to pet. You just pet the air. Don't oh, snafu! No, don't be hit again. Oh, phew! Oh, phew! Um, let's let's eat some nice cream. Illustration of a hug. Thank you. No, don't kill me. I don't want to die. Uh, back in. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Come here. That's great. I don't mind. Uh, what? Seeking affection. Uh. Pet curls up in your lap as it pet is pet by you. It also is comfortable as it falls asleep. <sighs> okay, just stay asleep. It wakes up. It's so excited. Oh, I'm gonna die. Dang it! Defending the ground with his front paws. Um, let's let's have so a spider donut. Yay! If you're here to have like someone who's really good at games, you came to the wrong channel. Uh, pet. It's exceeding the power, it's creating the power for the fence petting. Uh, okay, Raider Dog is petting the ground with its front paws. Pet. Is this segment? It's creating a power field that prevents. Pe oh, okay. I know what I need to do. Okay, it's getting easier. Play. Make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. I'm dumb. It flats to the ground. The dog picks it up. The snow in the area and brings it to you. Oh, that makes me think of my dog fudge. Now, dog is very tired and rests his head on you. Okay. Good. Phew! Your dog wants some TLC. I will pet you then. As you pet the dog, it sinks the entire weight into you. Your movement's slow. Oh no. But you still haven't pet enough. Oh, crud. Pet capacity is 40%. Uh, pet. You pet decisively. Pet 100%. Good. Flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Oh, crap. I didn't die. Mercy spare you. Ooh, snafu. Oh, so lucky there. Thank you. I'm going to... I'm so glad I have all that stuff. Ah, that's cute. Little puppies. I want a dog. I really want a dog. Okay, let's use an item. Info. Spider heals 24 HP made with whole spiders. Not just the juice. That seems... Uh, all HP. One slice. Okay. Then I'm going to use... Butternut pie. Okay, scotch pie. Your HP was maxed out. That's fine with me. I mean, I mean, there might be a save point really close, I can't remember. 
but I didn't want to like all of a sudden meet somebody and then die with two health left. Heal, man! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold the consulate of deadly terror. Uh oh, that's like very dangerous. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing up, vi up violently, up and down and up and down. Only the tiniest change of victory chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. <laughs> Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. Sure. That uh doesn't look very activated. Well, it's the challenge. It seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yes, yeah. We can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Nah. Sweet. Oops. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. I did, but the greater dog was unfair with it. <gasps> Welcome to Snowden. Yeah, it was another saving point, but that's okay. I'm going to sell some things. This site. Site of Fetter Friendly Talents to do with determination. Save! Do 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 do. Use the box? Yes. I'm going to take out the tough glove and the toy knife because I'm going to sell them at the shop. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? I'm going to sell. Huh? Sell something? Does it look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but if I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I would be out of business in a jiffy. What? I can't sell things to you? Buy? I'm going to buy... I have a lot of money. Hold on. Hold on. Then I'm going to exit for a second. Fine. Yes, use the box because I'm going to put that back and that back. I want manly bandana. Because it will upgrade my armor because I'm not the greatest at games, and I'm going to buy two bicycles and a cinnamon rope bun. Yes, one more cinnamon bun. Okay, exit. I'm going to talk to you. I you need a cool voice. <sighs> Hello, Hello, traveler. How can I help you? We're gonna talk. Care for a chat? Hello. Hiya, welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? Yes. What do you do here? I want to know what you do here in Snowden. Gobies has food and the library... The library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap in the end. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them, brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Town history. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back in the forest. Long, short story. We all decided to leave the ruins and head for the caverns. End of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided to they liked the cold and set up this camp. Set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages. So unless you're a ghost or you can burrow under the door, forget about it. Oh, was that part of the ruins that I tried to get in before? with the mushrooms. Your life. Life is the same as usual. A little cla claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? 
as long as we've got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face some struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? That is true. Okay, so I have 58 gold left. I'm gonna... I'm really sad that I can't sell things. Does this look like a pawn shop? I wish! But I don't! I have cool stuff! I have really cool stuff. Bye now, come again sometime! I gotta save again. In. Welcome to Snowden. Snowden's premier hotel. One night is ADG. Oh, leave. I can't. I don't have ADG. Well, feel free to come back anytime. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. That's maximum. What's that? Max, max, maximum. Maximum HP. Okay. Um, okay. We still have a little time to, like, do some wandering around. Don't want to walk to the other side of town. Try the under snow tunnels. They are efficiently laid out. Okay. I'm gonna talk to people. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. What about it? Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee hee! Aw, Christmas. Christmas is coming soon. Awful teens tormented a mo local monster by decorating the its tree like horns. Yeah, so we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Oh. Okay, I guess I could have done that. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Do 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 do. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various lo locals. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Oh, wait, I didn't, um. Hold on, I just remembered. Item. Use. You cooked manly bandana. So... Yay! I got a bandage. How'd I get a bandage? Okay. Oh, I can drop items if I can't sell them. Okay, that's good to know. So if I run out of space later, I can just drop the toy knife and the tough gloves if I can't sell them. This town doesn't have a mayor, but if there's ever a problem, the skeleton will tell you, tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help, I want new drinks and ha, hot guys. <clears throat> Isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil, and when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I love to try it sometime. It's quite delicious. Hamburgers are really great. Capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm, I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture. Erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip into their slip onto their butts. Okay, I get that. Okay, I was like, "What in the world? The jukebox is broken." Aw. Grills, grills, bees said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff because he's fire. Those dogs are part of the royal guard. An elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. So it's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. I put out a line for some girls today. Somebody told me that they were plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm talking of taking that seriously. I'm literally gonna make out with a fish. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. <laughs> I'm thinking of getting a spiked color to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. Huh. Come on. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump onto your lap and give you lots of love and attention. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We'd love bones. Okay, hold on. Hair, it's getting in my ear. 
happen sometimes. Okay. You got a pretty scarf. Oh, well, what's these flowers? Oh, I just walked right through them. Everybody is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crises. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I just not very funny. <sighs> we all know that the underground has problems, but we smile anyways. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morse about it? Morose about it. Let's go up here for a second. <clears throat> Let's play monsters and humans! You aren't gonna make me the, be the human again, are you? Humans are great! Ah, to be young again, the world just felt, sure felt boundless. Ah, what a beautiful knock! Maybe, if I don't answer, I will hear it again. Ah, my patient rewards me. No problem. I'm really good at knocking at doors, actually. Like, I have a good strong knock. Makes sense, throw ice cubes into the river. That's just creepy. Can I do anything? Nope. It's just creepy and quiet. Okay. The Libar... Libarby. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is spelled, misspelled. It's kind of like a... S <laughs> oh, man. Anyways, sorry, it's kind of like, um, sometimes when you accidentally misspell something and people, like, in a text or whatnot, and people are like, What are you talking about? You misspelled this. It's like, I'm sorry, I know. <sighs> that look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumbles, aren't you? Oh, yes. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report, it's just filled with comics and games. That's nice, because they're made, they're made of magic. Monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Aww. Therefore, if, being, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire just to kill, um, let's end that chapter here. Let's talk to this lady and then read all the books. Cough, cough. When I was your, when I was younger, my teachers gave me words such as when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. That was like a little sassy for this old lady. I thought they were a waste of time, but look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Okay, let's read all these books. It's a school report about monster funerals. Oh, monster funerals, strictly speaking, are cool as are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on the person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Oh, ah, oh. I'm at the page at the page minimum yet. Oh, <laughs> I do that all the time. I'm at the page minimum. This kind of I'm kind of sick of writing this. While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us, but they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. That is true. I would really like to use magic in my life. Like, like I really like sparks fly and they fly. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. What if I wanted a pa bullet pattern birthday? Here I am writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry. I'm still writing that one. Okay, but did I read this one? They are made of magic. Monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. Okay, yeah, I did read this one. If the monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more the attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful sword struck with a desire to kill, um, let's end the chapter there. Well, what would happen? Monster History Part 4. Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city home. We braved harsh cold, damp swampland, and searing heat until we reached what we now call our capital, New Home. Again, our king is really bad at names. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of, but the absolute nature of the soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these to exist. I think so. Okay. Let's continue on. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled papyrus. Look inside. Sure. It's empty. 
Let's knock on the door. It's locked. And if I wanted to go back, which I might, it's locked from the inside. Okay, I'm going to go through here, and I'm going to save, and then I'm going to end the episode here. I know this last bit's been a little bit more like just being adventurous and looking around, but it's good to look at everything, you know, in any other RPG game. It's good. All right. So, thank you so much for watching. I think I probably will record one more episode of this before I turn in for bed um, and stop recording. But thank you so much for watching. I really have enjoyed playing this game. It's just super cute. Um, and I'll catch y'all next time. Bad route.